Right, race one, race 27 on in, in the car, but race one on day three is the Batfair Handicap Chase over two miles, six furlongs, 0 to 140 for five years and up. One is Sky Run, Sky Run Drove, Davy Robinson, H. N. Burn, Martin Needham, Dimwit, Craig Batworth, Fiddler's Baino, Davy Robinson, Double Chance, Stu, uh, Davy Hoagie, Bear, Graham Clutterbuck, Lady Ravana, Patrick Hogan, Oil Baron, Graham Clutterbuck, Ruby Gallup, Darren French, Seagrave, uh, Darren Thompson, Orlando Princess, Vinnie Gerard, Lambeth, Johnny, Alex Cherry, Patricia's Brig, Stu Gray, Storm Crow, Patrick Hogan, Dalloway, City Bell, Vinnie Gerard, and Maximum Mayhem, Alex Cherry. Nice big field, yeah? And at the start, and away they go. They come to the first, and up on the inside, Lady Ravana jumps at best and goes to lead from Seagrave on his outside. Uh, then comes Lambeth Johnny in those orange colours, uh, orange cap, orange sleeves. Uh, be between horses moving forward now is H. N. Burn, Dimwit on that one's outside. Dave Hoodie's horse on the inside is uh, Double Chance. On the outside of Double Chance is Orlando Princess. Maxim Mayhem is very wide, with Stu Gray's horse even further wide, Patricia's Brig. Behind that is Fiddler's Baino. Uh, the second, Davy Roberts' horse is Skyrone Drove, with Oil Baron on his inside. The grey horse at the back of the field is Ruby Gallop and Double Chance has dropped to the back of the field. So it's the two Patrick Hogan horses a lead yeah, Storm Crow and Lady Ravana, but Lambeth Johnny is moving up on the outside. Then comes H. N. Burn, Dimwit, who's on the inside of Orlando Princess. H. N. Burn has dropped back up on the rail is um, C. Gray for Darren Thompson. Moving through between horses, Oil Baron for Graham Clutterbuck. And then comes Out Wide Bear for Graham Clutterbuck. The two Davy Robertson horses close together. Uh, Skyron drove just ahead of Fiddler's Baino. Delaware City Bell is on the outside of Ruby Gallop. And at the back of the field, we have double chance for Dave Hoodie. So Lady Ravana leads for uh, Patrick Hogan from Lambeth Johnny on his outside. Then comes Dimwit on the inside, on the outside of Storm Crow with Orlando Princess for uh, Vinny Gerard. Just another one's outside. Behind that, H. N. Byrne with Seagrave on his inside. Ruby Gallup moving up on the inside. Then comes Oil Baron. Behind that comes Scar and Drove. Out wide is uh, Patricia's Brig for Stu Gray. The second Vinny Ray Gerard horse is Delaware's City Bell. Then comes Fiddler's Baino. Bear at the back of the field with with double chance. We had a fall of them. Maximum Mayhem's gone. So it's Lady Ravenna who leads from Lambeth Johnny in second. Dimwit about three lengths further back with on his outside Orlando Princess. On the inside of that is Storm Crow. The grey horse just behind them is Ruby Gallup. Then comes H. N. Burn who jumps out well. Oil Baron is on the outside of Seagrave. On the rail is Delaware City Bell moving forward between horses in the turquoise and pink stripes is Scar and Drove. Just behind that is Fiddler's Bainer with Bear on his outside. On the rail we have Double Chance and Patricia's Brig has dropped to the back of the field for Stu Gray. It's Lady Ravenna with 12 furlongs left to travel who leads here yeah, from Lambeth Johnny in second Alex Cherry is also in second third is uh, Vinnie Gerard in the green colours Orlando Princess the second Padre Gauganos they pass the Winnie Pass they head in the final circuit is Storm Crow H. N. Burn is out wide in those red colours for Martin Needham then comes Ruby Gallup just behind uh, Dimwit uh, Seagrave is moving up on the outside of Ruby Gallup then comes uh, Scar and Drove for Davy Robertson on the rail is Delaware City Bell Oil Baron in between horses behind that with on the out and the inside of that fiddler's baino bear past one or two double chance is still on the rail for dave hoody and at the back of the field patricia's break for Stu gray New leader, Lambeth Johnny goes to the front. Bad mistake by the long-time leader, Lady Ravenna, has allowed Orlando Princess to move up on his outside. Trapped behind horses is Storm Crow. Then comes H. N. Byrne with Dimwit on his outside. Delaware City Bells on the inside of Ruby Gallop. Then comes Seagrave. And a faller there, Bear's gone. Bear unseats him well back in the field. And Lambeth Johnny with a mile to go is three lengths clear now of Orlando Princess in second. Lady Ravenna, after their mistake, is trying to move closer again. The outside of that, Storm Crow balloons that done the faller there H. N. Byrne has gone for Martin Leader. so Lambeth Johnny leads from in second Orlando Princess on the outside of Lady Ravenna then Seagrave is on the outside of Dimwit on the inside of that Storm Crow up the inside is Delaware City Bell with Ruby Gallup just alongside that one on the outside of those is Scar and Drove moving forward now is Double Chance Fiddler's Banner just behind and Oil Baron is just ahead of Patricia's Brig as well out of touch at the back of the field Lambeth Johnny still clear but here comes a rallying Lady Ravenna travelling well in third Orlando Princess Dimwit and Seagrave are going well creeping closer all the while though 
below is Delaware City Bell. In between horses, Ruby Gallop. That's the grey horse in the red colours. Then comes Ruddy Storm Crows. Dropped, dropped back with Sandra Ruddy. Oil Baron behind that. And now double chance is getting going for Dave Hoody. It's Lambeth Johnny as a jumper next. Who's clear from Ruby Gallop who suddenly moved up into second. Then comes Orlando Princess and Lady Ravenna. Up the inside, Delaware City Bell. Seagrave is getting going with Oil Baron. It's still Lambeth and jo Johnny in front for Alex Terry from Ruby Gallop in second. Oil Baron trying to get going with the two Vinnie Gerard horses, Lander Princess and Delaware City Bell. Uh, between horses, Double Chance, who was bolt for some galloping room, is slightly in the clear, but Ruby Gallop comes to pick it up for Darren French. And Ruby Gallop has gone clear for Darren French here, forming second. Orlando Princess is trying to get to this leader, but it's Darren French's Ruby Gallop from Orlando Princess. Then Seagrave, Double Chance between horses for Dave Hooney. Oil Baron is out wide, but it's still Ruby Gallop as they come to the last. of uh, for Ruby Gallop's gone, we're looking like a winner. Out wide, Oil Baron, Lando Princess up the inside, Seagrave in between horses, it's Orlando Princess, Oil Baron out wide for Graham Clatterback, Orlando Princess, Oil Brave, and it's Orlando Princess who wins from Oil Baron. But he got to count himself a lucky winner because they weren't finishing strongly and Ruby Gallop was going well enough to think that Ruby Gallop would have won that race when falling at the last. But Orlando Princess wins for Vinnie Gerard from Oil Baron in second, Seagrave was third, double chance back in fourth. And on the inside, Delaware City Bell never really picked up back in first for Vandy Gerard. But Darren French, really unlucky. Ruby Gallup looked a winner with, a f with one fence left to jump.